Hey Juan, it's me QP83. And Barbie0913. And today we're here with uh, two brand new dolls for both of our collections here. These are from a company on AliExpress called Bomelon? Something like that? B-O-M-E-L-O-N. -E uh, so it's an AliExpress store and they have a bunch of very fun SD sized BJD style dolls. Uh, and they come fully clothed with the wig and like the makeup done and the outfits, all of it. So it's really, I really like my, my doll. I think their faces are really cute. So we wanted to show them off to you. So we have two here. One I bought for myself and one uh, was gifted to my mother for her birthday. So they come with the wig cap. There's a little plastic piece that goes in here and then there's Velcro on the top and the back and, this, and push, push this little plastic piece along the ridge that you open up to change eyes on her skull. Which I think she looks cute without anything. Yeah, no, she has a cute face. They have various face molds, I believe, and their characters have names. So this is Mina, and I think mine is called Amy. Uh, and as I said, they come with various outfits and accessories and all the fun stuff. So for the price of the doll, you get everything you need to, to have a starter doll. It's not just a naked doll that you then have to, like, spend $100 to get all the accessories for her. <laughs> right. So that, this is the wig that my mom's originally came with. So they're SD size and they're super poseable, as you can see here. They're double jointed. Can't really tell because of the tights on mine. The knee joints do look a little weird. Yeah, they look flat. Mm -hmm. yeah, it goes like this. But it does allow the knee to bend really well. And then they kind of twist right above, so you can like twist the legs out and twist the legs, um, you know, in. Whereas some dolls have that in like the thigh, and oh, these yeah, don't have it in the thigh. It's got it in the knee. knee. Right. She's also double jointed at the elbow. So you will have uh, that double jointing in the elbow as well. Uh, and yeah, the one thing about these guys, you can see the elbow. And it has that twist above the elbow too. So the quality of the outfits I think does vary. Because I really like my outfit and this one looked prettier in the promotional shots than it did and it's not like sewn perfectly. Um, but it is nice because they all have body suits, so you get that automatically, you don't have to buy that. There's a body suit underneath here. So you then staining isn't as much of an issue with it. It with dark clothes. It's usually with more with dark clothes than yeah. anything. And it is something to be maybe a little bit concerned about on these guys, just because their arms and legs are like this hard plastic, but their torso area and like their neck is a softer, more pliable vinyl. Mm -hmm. So it kind of feels more like flesh. It does feel like flesh. Uh, and it's like, you can tell there's- You can a, press it. Yeah, there's a different feel and you can like squeeze into the body uh, and kind of feel the skeleton underneath it. Yeah. You can squish it. Yeah. So the bodysuit is, is pretty helpful in that because I think that would stain more than the, the hard plastic yeah, stuff. Yeah, I think so too. So she doesn't necessarily need it all the way down. It's like mine goes to a pair of shorts. Right. And she's wearing one to the shorts And they as have well. panties on. So. Yeah, it's super nice. Like, you can totally get your doll. Um, like, it's nice when you can get one that's fully clothed. Even if you're going to redress her anyways. Like, it's nice that they have something in the box. Yeah. <laughs> um, but they have pretty faces. I think their faces are really cute. And their face-ups are really well done. I like her Stuck eyes. There. She's really pretty, her eyes. She looks yeah. like this little ballerina. Mm hmm She has a very, uh, like... Innocent. She's got an innocent... Innocent expression, She yes. does. That's why I like her with the short hair and make her look a little younger. But, yeah, she's very innocent. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, and mine, I think, has a very inquisitive sort of look. It's probably the glasses. <laughs> but... And, and they're a little shorter than... The uh, other SD doll. Yeah, I believe it was when you order these dolls, it says they're between like 55 to 60 centimeters. So it doesn't tell you specifics. So I think these guys are on the smaller, smaller end of that scale. They're shorter than my other girl. Yeah. But I actually really like them. I think that the quality is really nice. I think they stand really well. I love that you can get a full outfit. And I think their faces, as I said, their faces are done really, really well. And there's so much expression to their eyes. And this size furniture 
they sit well in there and their legs don't extend too long too so it works really well for them yeah but these are uh, just some dolls from from aliexpress yeah not too badly priced if you consider what you're getting with them you're getting um, a full set yeah i would just probably like like i said i like her face but you can also order these dolls naked and fine you can do like an a la, car, a la carte thing like you can order the naked doll and then you can find order an like find an outfit from the same store and find a wig from the same store so you could do that and i'm sure that if you wanted like this face with a different outfit you could just send them a message um because yeah as i said i probably wouldn't order this outfit again but mm -hmm. i think this one's really nice and she's got a lot of pink she's got pink under her eyes she's got pink lips yeah and she is more of the she's got the salmon more yeah. of the orangey color yeah so they each have their own little like different they each have differences on their face not just in their mold, but also right. their painting. And I like her. I like her little jacket that comes with it. I think it's adorable. Yeah, I like the bunny, uh, the bunny hoodie. Yeah, that is cute. cute. It's just this that let me down. The because it's so short. Like it's oh. so short. And it was really wrinkled, and you can't get the wrinkles out. They won't come out. Right. Um, but yeah, otherwise, and it's you know in the nature of a BJD, you're gonna redress it anyways. So, right. in the end, it's not a huge deal. But I think the quality of these dolls are, are yeah. really nice, and I will totally be ordering another one. Too bad they don't do boys. No, no boys. I would like a boy to go with this girl. But as you can see, they each have different personalities. They do sell the glasses on the website as well, by the way. Which you, I will be getting soon. You can get them with or without lenses. These are without lenses uh, for glare and such. But, yeah. They can do weird things. Like They can totally... They can bend really well. I like her that she came with boots. Yeah. I think the boots are cool. The boots are really cool, and they have a zipper in back, so you don't really have to mess with any of the lacing. Um, and they also sell the shoes in their store. So as I said, you can totally get a naked doll, choose the shoes you want, choose the outfit you want, and then get it all in one package and, and basically have the same thing for, I think, the same cost that you'd pay for a full doll. What about as far as shipping? You ordered two. Did you have to, do, did you have to tell them so they could adjust the shipping uh they don't combine shipping for these specific oh. dolls because they are this as tall and long as something can be to ship out apparently oh. so like they told me that there was no way they could put them in another box because then it would be too big to ship oh. so in that respect that you know you do have to pay shipping twice but i don't remember it being that bad I mean, you still get these dolls for like under a hundred bucks. And the bo two boxes, they were in two separate boxes. They were taped together, so they were a set, so they knew they were a set. Oh, okay. Yeah, when they came in. Yeah, I didn't know that because I was not here. Right. That's cool. So they did kind of ship together. Kind of, yeah. <laughs> because you don't want one to be somewhere lost, crazy place and one to finally right. arrive at your house. So. I think they kind of remind me of like k-pop stars like they, yeah they have k-pop faces they're fun she, i love this outfit on here yeah it is i do like this outfit i order i ordered her schoolgirl outfit too just you know to have so she can switch into yeah. switch characters every now and then um and then i i ordered one that's like a, a goddess kind of outfit which might go mm -hmm. better with the pink hair i'm not sure could go with the short hair too yeah i think it's just see yeah but the, the wig is a nice quality, and when you wonder what the little plastic piece is that suddenly falls out of your package, it's for her wig cap. Yeah, I had no idea. I was like, what is this thing? I know. <laughs> I sent her a message at work. I'm like, that's what it's for. It goes for the wig cap. And she's like, huh? <laughs> I'm like, huh? Oh, and they have some funky stands, too. So if you um, are on their website, you can get a stand that, like, holds their waist. And then, like, you, you can, can put them in, you know, different positions that you wouldn't be able to with a stand where it's just her legs. So you can, like, make her do an arabesque or make her look like she's jumping or kicking or fun things like that. But they're so much fun to play with. I love to play with the wigs and stuff and the clothing. I need more people who have just used clothing that I can buy for them. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that is, uh, these are some of the dolls from the ba Bamalan store on AliExpress, which I'll link to down in the description area. Um, I don't know, what do you think? Would you, like, order one again? Oh yeah, because you're not worrying about the face-up. It's a pretty face-up. I mean, it's mm -hmm. really nice. That looks like something that you would pay for a custom face-up. 
just doesn't look like some simple, okay, this is a blank doll here. It looks like every other one of them. Right. Because she, I mean, her face, it's all the eyes and the lip color and everything, and she mm -hmm. looks really good. And then you got extra eyelashes. Yeah, they gave us eyelashes, reason. which, you know, I guess because maybe they'll fall off well, you and didn't. even replace it. You got extra eyelashes. Right. I didn't. Maybe, well, they probably thought we shipped it together. Oh. So. Oh. It was probably because. Yeah, it was probably because yeah, <laughs> they shipped together. Oh. And I was the same customer. So. Oh. So you might get uh, a freebie as well. Yeah, but I would recommend if you're looking for an affordable SD, SD sized yeah. doll to play with. A beginner SD. Even if it's like a Christmas gift for like a younger collector, I would say this would be a good oh, one. Yeah. Because you don't have to put the head on. If you do mm -hmm. a, a resin one, sometimes you, you have to add that part and hook it on there or the hands or something. This, she came all together already by herself. Yeah, so definitely like a nice beginner BJD where you're not spending hundreds of dollars um, and you still get a nice quality doll. And you can still take her wig off and her her head off to put change eyes if you want. You can want. change your yeah. eyes. It still just looks like, like mine are like hot glued in, but you can probably just pull the hot glue off. Probably. So yeah, you can still change the eyes, you can still change the wig. So in that respect, to me, I'm 100% cool calling it a ball joint doll. Yeah. Even if it's not strong or resin or whatever. It's cute. Yeah, so that was uh, our long rambling video on these dolls. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully you got something from it. If you have any questions, leave them in the description. Enjoy the nice weather. Yes, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.